Howdy again, y'all. Sean from Cappy's Cards. And coming at you today with another of these videos where I open some product. And I really have been trying to find 2023 Topps Baseball. And I have not been able to obtain it yet, at least retail. The problem with my two local LCSs, the one, you know, here in Indianapolis and the one by where I work in Muncie. You know, the one in Muncie is only open weekends. And I'm not on campus weekends because I get the heck away from college campuses as fast as I can. And then the one here in Indianapolis, of course, you know, they have like afternoon hours and that's when I'm, you know, doing other stuff, right? So um, it's hard to get into them to get hobby stuff and things like that. I should probably just break down and order some online. And I've been watching for, you know, bulk products and things like that to come out as well. So if you're watching this and you got some bulk, either 2023 tops or football cards, any football cards you're watching, you want to sell me, hit the email that's in the description of the video and we can talk pricing and stuff like that. So you know what that means. That means I'm doing some more Walgreens stuff, right? Because can't find much of anything else. So these two boxes, again, it's been a while since I've done this. So I figured, what the hell, we'll do it again. And we'll try to supplement it with a pack of 2022 Absolute Football they had hanging there. So none of the other uh, special boxes, none of those ballpark packs, none of the other things like that. They had uh, archives, blaster boxes, but, you know, they're archives, blaster boxes. So uh, we'll just uh, go ahead and go through these again. If you're not familiar with this stuff, I'll put the links to the last few, you know, probably done this six, seven, eight times now, uh, down in the description of the video where you can watch uh, as I open and look for the hits in these products. Everything that you see that are in these boxes, unless I pull something stupid, is going to wind up here in my Etsy shop. That link is also in the description of the video where I do team bags and things like that. And just about through the latest football update, and then I'll go through and update baseball here, like I said, when I can get some 2023 product to mix into it and uh, have that ready here for spring training. And I'm going to do a spring training uh, sale as well over in the Etsy shop. So right off the bat here with these baseball products, I'm excited to see, if you watch the last couple of products, they had been 88 Donruss packs and they were searched, right? So something other than 88 Donruss in here, it looks like an 89 score pack. But of course, with these plastic baggy packs, you're not going to search them. And hey, some uh, heritage from this past year right off the top. So... That is 89 score, like I thought it was, so we'll leave that here. And let's see what we got, right? So, some actually 2022 cards mixed in. I'm happy to see that update as well in here, right? Because usually, these last few have just been a lot of the 1980s, 90s, junk black stuff with like one or two of these cards mixed in. Can't say I've ever seen on 2011 Contenders before. That's pretty interesting. That's 17 tops, right? Yeah. Another one of these... Prospect cards here from Contenders 2011, Austin Hedges. And then we venture back into the Junk Wax. I remember Jerry Naren as the manager of the Frederick Keys, going way back from where I grew up there. Of course, the Keys are one of those teams that got the shaft when they redid the minor leagues. And now they're one of those, uh, like, I don't know, college wood bat sort of leagues, as opposed to they were the single A affiliate for the Orioles way back then. Canseco is a Red Sox. Some leaf here. That's 91 leaf, right? Yeah. 92 Fleer. This is weird. This is almost like organized, right? Like whoever was packing these through just grabbed a couple here and a couple there. Uh, Bo Jackson is a White Sox. It's a nice card there for 93 or 94 score. 94. So that's pretty cool. Steve Avery, the other pitcher from the Braves at that time, right? Uh, with that, there's Gary Carter as a giant. So we're getting some stars in their other uniforms, more or less, right? That you kind of forget them in. Pinnacle. These are the most organized, you know, cards I've ever seen come out of a box. And yeah, we still only got a couple of modern cards, but like, you know, all the Pinnacle in a row, all the Leaf in a row, right? You know, some 90 tops in a row. So that's pretty different uh, coming through that. No hit, right, that time. Um... I don't remember if 89 score had some crazy search in it for some random autograph. I don't think there was any that early in score products, right? Uh, I think that came in the early 90s when they started putting in various things. So 89 score, nice and packed fresh here. Anybody good? Not yet. And these annoying things, right? Mookie. Mookie Wilson going to be our best card in this pack? Yikes. All right, it's not a search pack because you can't, you know, if it was searched, we would know the way these things are open. It's just 
not a good pack <laughs> um, that time. So what did we get on our Ruth Rises to the Occasion? Yay. So throw that over here. All those will, like I said, get mixed in when I do the baseball update here. I got one more football team to do, and that's Washington, and then all the football will be updated this go around. I'll try to get some updates to them soon, right? Because, again, I'm already sold out of a handful of teams uh, with the football products. So uh, hopefully we can take care of that soon. I got two packs this time. Or the one of them is this LSU pack. And we got some score again, 1990 score. So a couple of baggy packs. And poor Zach Wilson, right? Just, you know, the long line of Jets quarterbacks that haven't worked out. Uh, that his prism rookie is going to land in this. Keenan Allen's nice from Absolute. St. Brown, that's a heck of a card to find in here, right? I mean, yeah, it's college uniform still. Prism, right? Red, white, and blue is kind of nice, right? That's that's not bad for a, you know, pull out of a football product like this. So I'm going to set that one aside. That's nice. That still will wind up in my Lions packs the next go around when I update them. They happen to be one of the teams I am sold out of right now. Some 89 football. And when I turn around like this, I get excited thinking it might be something. Of course, it's not. Demarcus Lawrence, right, from the Cowboys, CMC there from last year's Donruss. That's another thing that I want to see if I can find, but man, you remember when Donruss, when we were kids, right, like the Donruss baseball card packs were like 30, 40, 50 cents in 1990, right? I remember getting a whole wax box for like five bucks, right? Now, what's a hobby box of Donruss football this year is like 230, 250, something like that I saw, maybe more. So, yeah, that's that. Anybody recognize? Well, David Woodley was a quarterback for the, the Super Bowl team for the, the Dolphins, right? Um, hey, I got a checklist. Ooh. Um, and I don't recognize any of these other people. Folks that went to LSU are watching this going, oh, yeah, that guy, he's wonderful, right? And I have no idea who any of them are. You also note I didn't get the hit either in this box. So maybe we'll get super extremely lucky with the absolute pack over there to find something. Of course, 90 score is sort of the, you know, when you buy bulk football cards, you always get 90 score, just like 90 Fleer. Always find their way in somehow. Sterling Sharp, Singletary, Barry Sanders, that's nice. Sard, Montgomery, Andre Ware. That would have been a decent card in 1990, right? He's not bad as a commentator for college football on ESPN. I don't mind him that much. i got to do some of the other commentators that are out there. Let's see if we get... Super lucky here in this 20-card absolute pack. And, you know, with, I'm not, you know, read the fine print all you want there for whatever that says. I don't even think it's discussing autos and stuff. So, you know, let's get the kid reporter card out of the back. Knock yourself out if you want it. There you go. Justin Herbert on the top isn't bad. Mixon. Devontae Adams. And Tyreek Hill. Nice. Hopkins. A-Rod. Parsons. Already got him in my set or my personal collection out of this. AJ Brown. Taylor. Kenny Pickett rookie. So I've already got one Kenny Pickett rookie in the Steelers packs now. So the next time I do them and update them, might mix that one in as well. So that's not bad. Uh Jahan Dotson, Woods, Pierce. Who we got here? Tony with sort of a purple color there. His Super Bowl punt return, man, that was the real turning point in that game. Uh, Brandon Cooks, Romeo Dubs, The Storm, by Storm, Aiden Hutchison. That's a nice card. Pretty neat little design on there with Kyle Hamilton behind him, right? But it's a neat card that, again, you know, the Lions are going to get some nice stuff mixed in. A couple of nice Lions cards that we pulled out this time. So, hey, you know, pretty standard pull for these, uh, you know, Walgreens packs, right? Nothing... Overly spectacular, although I do like seeing, you know, some differences in the baseball now. It's not the search packs they were before. And, you know, it's, it's how it is. These things will just wind up getting mixed in with all the other product that I have. So, hey, give me a like and subscribe on here if you like videos like this. I'll do some more search videos here soon as I uh, go through some various products that I've purchased here to, you know, beef up my baseball card packs. And especially as I get a 2023 box at some point, I'm sure I will. I'll be able to go through and find these things and not strike out as much as in retail. And if you watch this and you know what retail product, you know, where to go, right? I've been to Target and Meyer and Walmart, all those things by me, right? And of course, Walgreens too, um, you know, striking out left and right. So we'll see. Maybe I'll just break down order them online. But otherwise, thanks for watching and uh, we'll see you in the shop.